What? I think you can listen to Beethoven later. Beethoven? You think we live in the 16th century, Jane? Beethoven living in the 17th and 18th century. And do you wonder why people call you Jane Austen? No, they don't. Whatever. Anyway, you're ready to work here. Sure. What do you got? She is over there. You're not coming? I have seen it. It? Sounds like you don't want to get attached. Is it that bad? I have a kiss at home, so it is bad enough for me. I don't. One cadaver is as good as any other, I would say. This isn't like other cadavers. Jane? Yeah? Can you hold my coffee? Why? Because I think I might puke in it. You need to barf back. Screw you. You tried that, remember? Sure, we're both single. I don't work where I work. Isn't that an oxymoron? Face it, you just don't like me because I care. Your pistol is the least of my worst. You, you also, I, I didn't know. Listen, I'm not asking for a weekend fling here, all right? Just a cup of coffee sometime. Looks like you already have some. And this shepherd like a camera lens for some reason. Your kidney's a father and you're a royal pain in the ass. Hello. Yeah, no offense, but I really don't want my fingerprints everywhere. Uh, sorry, old Ukrainian custom. Detective Dobbs, it is Dr. Vitali. Doctor? Well, I'm sorry to break it to you, Doc, but I think we already know the diagnosis. A minor case of death. He specializes in cases like this, so shut up. Specializes? What do you mean specializes? Isn't this just another child murder? On the contrary, it's full of symbolism. Uh, that suggests something for more nefarious and organized in cases like this. Even handkerchiefs offer extremely valuable information. Handkerchiefs? I can explain later. Uh, for now I would like to direct your attention here. Well, it's no Picasso. I was called in this case because this apartment is full of suspicious symbolism. And by the way, the girl was murdered. Nothing was ordinary with this one. Clue in the dumb Englander, please. Dr. Vitali is convinced this was a network killing. Network? What kind of network? A pedophile network. If you look here, three hairs within themselves represents little girl lover. The FBI is aware of this as well. Hmm, could be a coincidence. 
Ever hear Valentine's Day? Here you have what appears at first glance to be a fish, when in fact it is a infinity symbol, a symbol connected to child murdering cults where they believe the killed child then live forever after the brutal demise. Brutal like that. What f fish traditionally use in ancient Roman times for Christians to help identify one another? I read that in Quo Vadis, a Ukrainian book. Polish. Originally, yes, the fish was used amongst Christians, but unfortunately, Satanists have a habit of countering anything Christian. Surely you have heard of an upside down cross. Secret pedophile groups are now Satanists. Something tells me he'll say the Easter Bunny killed the girl. Ouch! Assault on the police officer! I police two genius. Two cops don't make a right. I think that makes sense. But something is bugging me. I'll admit it. Something about these images remind me of something. But I don't remember what. Surprise, surprise! Don't make me file a complaint about you. I'm this close to asking for a canine partner. There's nothing more I want than a little doggy to chase bad guys and I can pet him after work and he'll be the most adorable little thing I've ever seen. I'm this close to asking for that. Then I can technically call her a bitch without you making me spill my coffee. These symbols are not uncommon, detective. What? Uh, I need to take this. It's your boss. Да? Здравствуйте. Да нет, вот тут убийство, расследование. Да. Speaking of ancient times, I do recall from one of my history books that according to their pagan beliefs, it was unlawful to put a virgin to death. That's why whenever sick Caesar like Nero came into power, he would always have a girl raped before killing her. Girls back then had to be careful. Where are you going? Lunch. After this, Eric! Bang. Bang. But I would love. If you love me, won't you let me know? Won't you let me know? 